I would like to take a minute to review a couple of key things that you'll need to do for the Lesson 7 Skills Practice. I'm not going to review everything line by line on the skills practice, so make sure that you're reading all the instructions before you start the activity. And in addition to that, make sure that you participate in the Lesson 7 lecture before attempting the skills practice. Everything that you need to know to complete any of the skills practices is covered in the lecture. These demo videos should just be used as a backup to help you if you get stuck here or there. To get started on the skills practice activity, you'll need to download the supplied file, Lesson 7 underscore skillspractice.psd. It's saved on Google Drive, so when you click it, you'll have to open it in a new tab and then choose to download. It will appear that there's nothing in the file, and that's perfectly okay. That's how it's intended to be. When it's done downloading, we can go ahead and open it, and we can talk about what you should expect to see. So in this file, when you open it, the Layers panel should be open. If it's not, go ahead and open your Layers panel by using the Window menu and then choosing Layers. And then if you look at the Layers panel, there are a series of layer groups. I would recommend collapse the groups first so that you can kind of see what the game plan for the project is. There is a layer group called Students Design, which is where you'll work, Elements, Containers, and Backgrounds. 